Hey, this is Brett and this 2022 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Rubicon is stock number 22J96. I'm here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Wrangler headquarters. This 2022 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited has the two liter turbocharged four cylinder engine, puts out 270 horsepower, 295 foot pounds of torque, it's going to get you 24 miles per gallon on the highway, 21 city, for an average of 22 miles per gallon. I'm going to go all the way around in this video. This color is called Hydro Blue. I think the paint code is PBJ, if I remember correctly. And uh, we're just going to go all the way around. I'm going to take a look at the original window sticker and just go over the options on the, this particular Rubicon package. Shoot all my videos in 4K, and if you like the video, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper right-hand part of the screen. Get the seven-slotted grill there. It's kind of got the, it's not really granite crystal, but uh, the gray interior, or the gray accents on there. And the headlight bezels, factory fog lights. This one does have the plastic bumpers, the painted red tow hooks. You get the sport hood on there. Note, you do get the little Jeep logo front of the headlights. The halogen running lights on the fenders it does have the black fenders and the black hardtop. This one comes with the painted and polished aluminum 17 inch rims. These are BFG or BF Goodrich all-terrain TA KO2 tires. These are LT285 70R17s and they've got an all-terrain tread pattern to them. Um, I think BFG is some of the best tires out there, my opinion. Um, Get the little sandals on that plastic surround there. You get the Jeep climbing up the side of the windshield. You get the T50 on the doors. You can take these doors off. I actually did a video showing you how to take the doors off if you want to check that out. You get the granite crystal Jeep logo with the red outline there. And it does come with the rock rails. This is part of the uh, Rubicon package that you get standard. It does have the enter and go system. We'll take a look at the original window sticker here. Feel free to pause this. I'm not going to go through everything, but most of it. Uh, 2022 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Rubicon 4x4. Has the Hydro Blue Pro Coat, black interior, leather trim bucket seats, the 2 liter i4 dual overhead cam, direct injection turbo engine with start stop, 8 speed automatic transmission. Everything on your left hand side is your standard equipment. You get Jeep, Jeep Wave membership, which gives you some oil changes and um, stuff like that. Has Sirius six uh, XM radio for six months, Sirius traveling for five year with a five year subscription and Sirius traffic plus with a five year subscription as well. Hydro Blue Pro Coat is a $395 option. The leather trim bucket seats are $19.95. This one does have the cold weather group which gives you the remote start, heated seats and heated steering wheel. This one has the Tow, trailer tow and heavy duty electrical group, which is 995. This Jeep is able to tow up to 3,500 pounds. You get the auxiliary switches, the 240 amp alternator, 700 amp maintenance free battery, and the class two receiver hitch, seven and four pin wiring harness as well. Hardtop headliner by Mopar is 525 and the all weather floor mats by Mopar are 170. The automatic transmission is 2000 bucks and the windshield with Corning Gorilla Glass is 295. I'll show you how to tell if your windshield has the Gorilla Glass on it or not. A black three-piece hardtop is $16.95 and that comes with the Freedom panel storage bag, the rear window defrost, rear window wiper washer, and no soft top. Total MSRP is $56,650. If you want to get your summit price in the upper right hand part of the screen is a link to our website with all the pricing and rebates and um, incentives on this vehicle. So click that and check us out there. Three-year 36 bumper to bumper, five-year 60 powertrain, there is your miles per gallon, 24 highway, 21 city, and 22 average. And then your front crash is four star and your rollover is three. They don't rate it for anything else. Uh, you can see you get those all weather topographic floor mats. I think they're pretty cool. This one does have the red dash. You get the black hard top. Coming around to the back, does have the backup camera and those are HD. There's your receiver hitch. You get 
four pin, seven pin wiring there. Back here, this one does have the Alpine uh, sound system with the subwoofer. You can see that insulated hard top. You get this piece here, this piece here, and then on the second row, you get that insulation as well. Just keeps it a little bit warmer in winter and also um, reduces a little bit of road noise when you're on the highway. Here's your soft top uh, or your soft bag for your hard top pieces. And to take these hard tops off, you have four bolts, three on the bottom, one on the top on each side for a total of eight, then two quick disconnects. I actually have a video showing you how to take your hard top off. If you want to check out that video, it's in the upper right hand part of the screen. A lot of people seem to enjoy it. So click that and check us out there. You get the JL badge on the back. Gives you two door, four door, wheelbase and overall length and water folding on there as well, as well as where it's built. And uh, the new JLs, those gates, they close a lot smoother than the old JKs. They're lighter as well. Heated mirrors, that enter and go system, you just have to have a key in your pocket, it'll automatically unlock. Inside, you get the leather bucket seats with the red stitching, Rubicon stitched into the backrest as well. These now have side airbags, standard. Lumbar, recline, get auto headlamps, power mirrors, power locks, we'll hop inside. Actually, we'll, we'll take a look back here real quick. Back seats. A uh, lot of room back here now. Latch child safety system. I think they made it a lot bigger than the uh, old JKs. Uh, the other thing that they've done is they made these go down a lot easier. And the other thing that they did is that you can have the headrest down now. Before when the seat was up, the headrest was automatically up. And uh, you can just put that headrest down like so. So just better visibility when you're riding by yourself. Back here you get your window controls, 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in, and then two USBs and two USB-Cs right there. That all-weather topographic format back here goes over the hump. They connect together, and you do get child safety locks in the back of the doors. Hop inside, check out the instrument cluster, the radio, and everything that this has to offer on the interior. So you can see that this one only has 11 miles, does have the digital speedometer and the seven inch LCD display, heated steering wheel. You get the red stitching on there, cruise controls, information and Bluetooth controls on the left, audio controls on the back. And this one has the 8.4 4C radio, which gives you the factory navigation system on here. You also have AM, FM and Sirius XM radio capabilities. You have your heated seats and heated steering wheel buttons. You can also check out your backup camera, which is an HD backup camera, so that is nice and crystal clear. And um, you have all your different apps on here as well, including the off-road pages, the projection manager, where you can project your cell phone to the screen. We actually did a demo on Android Auto with this radio, um, so you can check that out. That's in the upper right-hand part of the screen as well. And then we'll check out the off-road pages because they're pretty neat. Down here you have your climate controls, including your dual climate controls, start-stop capability, stability control, and speed crawl control. You may be lost but never stuck in a Wrangler. You have your steering angle here, which is pretty sweet. You can see that those wheels up top, they do turn as I turn the steering wheel, so that's pretty cool. Um, and on the Rubicons, you can see if your sway bar is connected or disconnected. Front axle, if it's locked or unlocked, same thing with the rear axle. Um, and if you're in four wheel drive or too high or whatever. Coolant temp, oil temp, battery voltage, trans temp, and oil pressure. And then you have your pitch and roll, as well as your latitude, longitude, and your altitude. We don't get any satellite signal inside the picture studio, so we don't have any information there. But second you go outside, that pops right up. Down here, your more tactile climate and audio controls, your heated seats and heated steering wheel button. Uh, power windows, you get a media center with a USB, USB-C, and AUX jack. This is your four auxiliary switches, part of that trailer tow group. And then you get the off-road plus mode, sway bar disconnect, and front and rear locking axles. Four-wheel drive, eight-speed automatic, you get your keyless entry with the flipper key. Um, 
I really like the new keys on the Wranglers. They're pretty cool. This one does have the remote start as well. Now when you're not using it, you can put it right there in between your cup holders. Get that red dash. Some people either really love it or just do not like it. I'm, I think it's okay. Get those uh, hard top pieces with the insulation on there. Um, assist and SOS buttons and then home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. We'll uh, start it up and then we'll take a final walk around. Now when you do get um, the Corning Gorilla Glass, it'll actually, it's got a grill on there and it'll tell you that you have the Gorilla Glass. It's just supposed to protect it better from rock chips um, and stuff like that. Because of the angle of these windshields on these Wranglers, they're kind of known for chipping and cracking and they're just trying to prevent some of that. But we'll do the final walk around here. You get the LED license plate lights. And I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. And hopefully from this HD video, you will have been able to verify the looks, styling, options, and uh, color of this vehicle. Now you got the, all your lights lit up there. Did just want to show you one real quick. The uh, Hydro Blue's got just a little bit of metal flake to it. It's kind of like a pearl coat. Really good looking color. Also, these are just stickers. If you didn't like those, you can always take those off. Anyways, thanks for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on my YouTube channel. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got it. Go to that website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. Click the bell notifications, you'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day here at Summit Auto. In fact, in a second you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to more Wrangler videos like this one in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out, and we're super excited to help you with this ultra clean, brand new 2022 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Rubicon in Hydro Blue Metallic. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on my YouTube channel. I really appreciate it.